Hi YouTube friends, it's Kamai Beauty here. So today I'm going to be making a video about what I'm deciding to go back to school for. Okay. As you already know, I'm a licensed cosmetologist in the state of Illinois. And I'm going back to school because basically I'm doing a career change to enhance the ambiance of my career field. Um, I'm not looking just to be a, you know, hair stylist or to be a skincare um, therapist or anything of that, but I felt like it was the first step of me understanding what it feels like to be in school um, and just getting a feel for uh, what I'm most interested in, which is the beauty field and some of the aspects of what I am going to be doing to achieve my dreams and goals. And just to give you a little bit more on, you know, why you should go to school and why you should uh, consider furthering your education so that you can be more valuable and become more of an asset in whatever company or if you decide to work for yourself. Um, as we already know, there's many college dropouts <laughs> and that's completely fine. You know, we have very successful people who have dropped out of school. Um, maybe it's good to do your research on why they dropped out and how they found their dreams but um, school is not for everybody, but I would say that it's important to at least try it to see if you like it. So, um, yeah, what I'm going to be going back to school for is communication um, and things like business. So I want to learn how to market. I want to learn more about entrepreneurship. Uh, it's going to be a little bit more liberal for me because with a communication BA degree, um, I will be a very wide range asset for, you know, like public relations. But for a public relations types of, type of job, you have to have internships under your belt and Thankfully, the school that I'm looking into going to, and hopefully I'll get accepted, which I'm sure I will, because I'm making the right steps in order to do so. I'm just hoping and praying that, you know, I'm going to get the most out of this experience because, you know, I'm looking to stay on campus and, um, you know, you know how you feel when you're a little kid and... <laughs> You go to school and you don't know what to expect. Well, this is how it is for college students in the adult world. So I feel like it's very fresh for me and it's going to be taken very seriously because, yeah, I'm going to be <laughs> in depth. But um, it's going to be smart because I'm doing something that's going to help my you know, my future self and my future endeavors that I'm going to um, be adventuring off into. So, yeah, uh, communication, marketing. I'm also interested in fashion, so I might take up on that elective class or something like that, a program. Um... And I want to be an asset to other people and their dreams. Like if someone needs me to help them with something and I know how to do it, I will be marketing myself, not only just what I'm doing so that I could have a following and people can be interested in my work, but for people to gravitate towards that, it makes you feel like, a very valuable person not that you're not valuable now because everybody is valuable in some type of way or another we just have you know different dreams and different things that we're good at different skills and skills that we can learn from each other and develop so 
I think that as well as having something under your belt for your future self, but to have that for, you know, the generations that are coming up into the world and also people who you're around, people who you're working with, groups that you're forming, uh, your friends, family, things of that nature. So, yeah. Um, I'm just very excited and um, I'll let you know what's going on as far as uh, if I got accepted, which I'm sure I probably will. I just have to be believing in myself more, you can say. <laughs> but, you know, as long as you get the things that you have to do out the way, you'll be fine. Um, this is a video to inspire people as well um, that are, you know, having a hard time thinking about what they want to go back to school for. It's very great to communicate with other people, visit schools, you know, do tours. I went on a tour today <laughs> and um, I very, I'm just very impressed with what I've seen and what I've heard and I think that you should try new things. You know, I feel like in this lifetime it's important to try things and to communicate with others and express your authentic self. I feel like this is the true beauty of being human and just helping people feel better about themselves by being yourself. It probably makes somebody else feel inspired and it makes them feel good about themselves. Like, wow, well, she's following her dreams and she's making things happen for her. Or he's making things happen for him. I'm just like, wow, amazed and astonished by you know, their essence and what they can do, you know, you could be just like them, but the difference is, is that you're you and you bring something different to the table in the world. And that, that's what makes you, your unique, your mark on the world unique. So don't forget that. That's something very important to think about every day. Um, <clears throat> so I was speaking to a friend earlier and she it's very similar to myself, and she has so many different interests about, you know, the arts, um, you know, mental, fundamental, you know, knowledge, uh, things that get pretty deep um, as far as helping people and just her natural expression of what she wants to do. And she wasn't sure about whether she wanted to go back to school or not. And she's like, oh, I have to start somewhere. But, you know, I just told her, you know, I'm going on this tour today and, you know, I'm going back to school and I feel very positive about it, you know. And she she's very humanitarian and yet she knows a lot about the system and she's, you know, against the system and why the system is like this. And that's a whole nother conversation to have. But um, I just know that I know where she's coming from because I see things too. I read things and I experience and I just do a lot of thinking on my downtime about how to make the world a better place and to make it you know, just for people to have a better experience here, you know, not a lot of people are fortunate to have the things that other people have, but I just feel like, yeah, that's materialistic gain, but you have to be present within your own inner knowing and your own, you know, higher self and what you have already achieved and Write down your goals, write down your dreams, write down what you're going to do to achieve all these things that you think and dream of and have visions of. And I feel like, you know, if you could do that, anything is possible. So, you know, just expressing to my friends and just inspiring them, I hope. And um, 
hope I can inspire you to maybe look into the things that you've been kind of, you know, unsure about and you've been second guessing yourself. Don't second guess yourself. Your your greatest strength is your inner knowing. Your your calling knows what you want. So just tune into that and, you know, practice some creative writing on <laughs> when, you know, you're alone or doesn't matter where you are, however you're comfortable. And um, do some reflecting for the 2018 resolution or whatever you want to do. So, um, yes, this is Kamaya Beauty. Stay pretty and stay smart. And happy holidays. Mwah.